Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Victoria 2 HFM, in which I'm your host, Mr. Spain Lover. Or really, Kingdom of Spain Lover. Also, I do love the Spanish Nueva España, but like at the end of the last episode, I'd say, we're going to take out a couple of Haitians. Because why the Haitians? Because why not? We love taking out Haitians here on the channel, so we're going to burn, pretty much burn the, the capital to the ground and basically try to paint the entire Americas some sort of shade of yellow. Whether it's very light yellow to almost beige to almost normal yellow or the Spanish yellow, ah, that's yeah, a golden idea. Don't don't look at look at don't look at the economy. No no no, red number does not exist. Oh my gosh, it's so bad. Um, but I already lowered off the administration because it's already 100%. Uh, don't worry about them tariffs. No 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 no. You see nothing, and that did no well, that had some sort of effect. Oregon Treaty. Oh, well, looks a little better for them. I'm just worried that America, they do have cores on all of the Spanish territory, so not a lot of guys around here. So we gotta make sure that we'll be okay. I wonder about that, please go right ahead. Okay, maybe at this point, maybe we need a, uh, a little higher tariffs. Okay, maybe very high tariffs. Sympathies, that's fine, whatever. Or maybe not. Maybe we should lower this side. And, eh, I don't know if it's gonna really help us out that much. Uh, there we go, too. Oh, hey, look, there's a button here. Oh, let's go that way, too. Oh my goodness, the economy's doing so... What, what is... Ah, I see why. I see why. Because we don't get any, any convoys and such. Um, I did say, like, buy the crap out of them. I forgot about that. My bad. They were right here. So, automate. There we go. Now we'll be doing okay. But now we won't be able to get any... Because uh, actually, our entire Navy died because we ran out of, like, convoys. So, that's not good. That's very, very not good. But in the meantime, we got to make sure we got a lot of alliances. Oh. Hold on. Would you like an alliance? No. UK, would you like an alliance? No. Uh, Prussia, would you like an alliance? No. Okay. Increase relations with those guys. And... From an alliance with these guys, that's fine. Nice. At least we've got some sort of ally here. If we end up in a war with America, then it probably won't do that great. But we'll see what happens. We're going to lower that as well. Excellent work. Thank you very much. Do you lower all the way? 25%? We still make some money. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hopefully, all we really need to do here is to do what? Well, oh, oh. Well, they have three transports. We have nine, so we should do okay. And we won. Yay! No extra ones, extra square. It's fine. Whatever. Ooh, Algeria. The French Republic killing them off. Uh, Chital Chital becomes part of the UK, which is fine. Whatever. Now, capturing the capital. I don't think it's going to be enough. No, it's not. Quite unfortunate. Cap. Ca Cap Haitian? How would you guys come out here and actually do this too? We'll see what happens. Of course, we can do some really reactionary stuff, but honestly, I don't like—I don't want to do any of that stuff. It's fine. Actually, we're we losing immigrants. Yeah, we are losing immigrants. Only 600 some. It's not bad. Chile, Brazil. I don't know why they're going there. Just because eventually we're going to get down there anyways, and they'll become part of us too. So, yeah. Um, like I said before, though, we gotta get, keep an eye on this. They're allied with Colombia, which does suck. We did take uh, Venezuela last time, which is awesome. I'll take out Brazil, but they're allied with these guys, too. Uh, who's this? Entre Rios. Entre Rios. Honestly, at this point, we, we're probably gonna need to take out Chile. Actually, you know what? Argentine Confederation is probably the way we want to go, so. We do have only two infamy, so. Not super worried about that. New Granada. We need Colombia. Peru. That'd be quite nice. And Bolivia. The Cap Capitanacy General of Chile versus the uh, Vice Royalty of Rio de la Plata. So. Oh, we need Uruguay as well. Who's stronger? Uruguay has a score of one. Honestly, going to Uruguay first is probably the thing we want to do just because. We can conquer something. Make it pop is easier. Uh, we'll risk it. We got enough of it for me. And I'll, and I'll save scum if it gets worse. Like, that'll be fine. Uh, we can probably spend a little bit more money on here. Yeah, if we really wanted to. Oh! I know they're not going to flip. Honestly, maybe I should have annexed them instead. But having them as a puppet's not a bad thing. Um, I wish there was a thing we could do with these guys. and Like, colonization, foot and Poe. I don't know. I think a lot of puppets is okay. If they ever break free, and actually we could always release them as a vassal. We do need to release them later on. That's fine with me. It's just that, I wish it was more yellow. Maybe we should have, maybe we should have annexed them. But oh well, as long as they're on us for now. It's not like Katie's going to ever become a superpower, right? Uh, but first, let's get to the comments, such as... Juan Van Halen was actually a real guy, which I said last time. Sebastian Garcia. We need way more forces here. Uh, got a couple ships here, too. Come back down to Port-au-Prince. 
And you guys do that. Go and do this as well. Ah, AT, thank you. Ah, oh, you all love to be in an alliance. An alliance of reactionaries. Um, so you guys are here. Go Nord. We have people here on our home base just because you never know what's going to happen at home. Uh, we'll still be making more divisions and stuff like that, but if we have rebels, we got to make sure we take care of them. Especially if they do that. Francisco Serrano. Well, I don't know if score too much, but I don't mind doing that. They're running out of guys. It's fine. Whatever. We still have slaves here. Filipinas. Geronimo. Mindanao. Oh, here. There you go. And the first army. So we had that guy somewhere here. Maybe he already died. Uh, or he is... Yeah, he might have died. And regardless, regardless. Another comment was, Los Altos is being uh, is being free of the bug. Yeah. Uh, we'll probably take him out. I'll probably release them. Unsphere them. Break our lines and kill them that way so that they're fully under us. So there's that. Uh, someone says I should have taken. The, actually, one of my Discord mods says I should have taken the FRCA early on because before I even started recording, we had a free cast of belly and I completely ignored it just because I want to go to with or go to war with Mexico first, pretty much. Uh, am I going to do the EU4 campaign next? That'd be cool. I I'm very bad at EU4. Like I'm okay. I'm just not very good at it. I have one campaign like playing the Ottomans. It's, it's a lot of fun, but I'm just not very good at it. Is the full unedited version of this on Twitch? Uh, unfortunately, not. I don't. I don't ever use Twitch. I think I. Have, oh. There's a lot of there's a lot of yellow there. Nice. A lot of Spanish people. Um, no, I don't really use Twitch. Like I said, uh, Twitch is all right. I prefer YouTube just because it's where I put literally everything on my channel. Also, we get we need to get railroads. So we, we want to make sure that we can industrialize someone as well. Which our industrial score is not great, but not bad. Uh, one of our end goals, as someone should say, is taking back all former Spanish territories, so including, technically the Louisiana Purchase was Spanish at 1.2, we'll take Florida, um, honestly, if I could take as much of America as possible, that's pretty much kind of what we're going to do, and I really want to build up California and make sure it's really nice, hopefully they get a lot of immigration here as well, got quite a few Mexicans, and a couple Yankees here too, and as someone asks, is H of M still being updated? That's a good question, I don't think so, and a lot of production's been sent over to GFM, which I have not tried out yet, which I do need to try out, so... Uh, their score is not bad. Their rank is 51. So as long as the military is big and large, that's all I care about. And another comment was, play in Tino as you none, which I will. I'm not sure when, but I promise I will play sometime. This is disgusting if you look it over here. The Moroccan incident with the death of Abd al-Rahmans in 1850. A dispute with Spain over the boundaries of Spanish enclave at Ceuta merged in Morocco. The Moroccans started to carry attacks in Ceuta and Melilla. And I'll go to this too. Um, threatening a population violating our territory. Uh, intervene immediately. We get, we lose to prestige, we get punitive expedition castles belly on Morocco, they get nationalist agitation, or Melilla does, let it go, or let's see the moment, moment in clear war, in which we can get the castles belly of humiliating them, which is okay. I prefer this one, intervene immediately. I want war ups. We could, actually humiliating wouldn't be bad. They don't have a small score, so I'm waiting for us to get our ships back over here, um, which should actually, should be... Pretty soon. Oh, we can go to your place. We didn't even get found out. Nice. Um, cool. Let you guys depart first. Thank you very much. And let's get on board. There you go. And let's go to war. Unit of expedition. We're gonna call in our little boys here. Little boys. That sounds really weird to say. Uh, call in our allies, and then we'll immediately pretty much go to war with uh, those other guys. Cool. Oh wow, Algeria's actually doing well against these guys, against the French Republic, huh? Make puppet, punitive expedition, nice. Well, let's go on in. And see what we can do. Oh, we're landing. Oh, we're killing them all off. Nice. Actually, can we actually just attack them here? Ooh, maybe, maybe not. Ooh, plurality, alright. Wait, where are they? Ah, Melilla. Ah, they're in our territory. Makes sense. We killed them all off. Not bad. Um, what is this? Negotiating unequal treaty. Treaty port. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. If we get those guys done. That'll be great. And then we'll, we'll literally send these guys over to the new world. So. And we didn't get found out. That's awesome. All the money we're making too. Love it. If I could spend more on education, we would. Taxes are low. Lower the tariffs maybe just a wee bit, and it's going to hurt our economy. God dang it. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, not bad. I'm, I'm loving this campaign so far. Not accept it. It's fine. Actually, is there anything else we could add here? No, it's not going well enough yet. Acquisition of French Algeria. 
They're at seventy percent. Oh, oh, they went over here too. Oh. There we go. Nice. Yes. Good. What do we want from them? The Ifni Treaty Port. The Ait Bamran tribe has long inhabited the small town of Infi Ifni and the region surrounding it. The Rukin husbandry and trade with the Europeans in northern Morocco being intermediate in this trans-Saharan trade. Ifni would serve as an excellent coaling station at Central and South. Southern. Oh, oh. Nice. Ifni. Oh, we're down here. Oh, wow, that's really small. I go build it up. Culture is Bebe. Nice. Um, if you want, go right there, hang out first, give it literally like a day. Oh. Well. Can you guys pick them up? There you go. Because now we're literally going to send you guys down here. We'll be a pain in the butt. Hopefully, we can get down there fast enough before America gets really involved. And just go to war with them. Anyways, that's a hope. Oh, what are you. We really need to form the, uh, Suez Can Suez Canal. Panama Canal. We need more population, too. We don't get that much population, either. I um, don't get me wrong. We're trying to get functionalism. We do want to get inorganic chemistry. And I'm going to be trying to push for as much army tech as possible so that we can beat up the Americans once the Civil War fires. So we got big plans. And, yeah, I definitely want to take these guys out. That'd be so good. Come on, hurry up. Get down here. And... Hello there! Oh, hey! More population growth. Exactly what we're talking about. We get social justice. Everyone loves social justice, right? Sure. And we've just saved. And let's go to war. Oh, hello. Oh, oh. Who cares about Paraguay? Oh, the Hungarian Revolution is going not well for Hungary. Huh. Just laying on top of them if you can. It's fine. Paraguay, we can deal with those guys. I don't care. Um, How's our budget? Oh, it's maxed out. That's good. About a month of video. Huh? Oh. And it's Algeria. Well, that's nice. Very nice, very nice. <clears throat> As we're hanging out. I mean, look at that infamy. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Melo? What's over here? Sikh Empire. Not bad. Honestly, I'm thinking about maybe going to China for at least one attempt just to get some population. I mean, is, would it at all be possible? Yeah, punitive expedition. I mean, that's going to cost a lot of guys as much as I want that. We'll see. We definitely want more population. Oh, we got also lost ships. Nice. Good job, guys. Um, if you really want to, just hang out here. Do they want to peace out yet? Paraguay, you want to peace out? No, you're going to have us burn this place to the ground, I guess, huh? Nice. Well, all right. So be it. Well, if we're down here already, one score, five score. Oh, well. First update region. All right, I love being reactionary. General Narciso Lopez, native of Venezuelan General Narciso Lopez, was executed by the Spanish colonial authorities in Cuba. He landed with a small group of men trying to incite a revolt that would turn the Cuba over to the U.S., but failed due to lack of support from the population. Cuba remained Spanish, as it should. See, we don't like this. Oh crap, that's not good. Hmm. We'll deal with them. Hmm, that's not good either. Hey, you got functionalism. That's good. Militancy. Why? Why is it so high? We're going to definitely have to deal with that one. Industry. We're going to go inorganic. We need the population. And we'll send these guys home after this too. Industry's not bad. Alright, guys. Bros. They're literally completely dead. You have to peace out with this. Can I get some... Honestly, we should have taken war score now, right? The oh, to counter the ravages of Cuban insurgents, the governor general instituted a policy of forced removal from all citizens of the countryside to the camps, to camps in the cities. Uh, denied six sources of supply and places to refuge of uh, insurgent forces. Um, I really don't want to go to Paraguay. I really don't. The ally with Chile, huh? Crap. Spain just does not have enough population. Ah, uh, this at this point, as much as I want those guys, we're gonna go soldiers. We need more soldiers, anyways. 
Um, you guys. Yeah, you're still doing bureaucrats over there. Oh, well, we got two infamy. It's not bad. Population wise, what do we have? Uh, do over here. Soldiers. I want more soldiers. Seriously, this is stupid. Give it up. You know what? I'm going to take a hit to infamy. I'm probably going to pop at them too. Screw it. Why not? Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, that's not good. What? Their score is 11. Hmm. Well, that's really not good now, is it? Well, I'm thinking we have to redo this battle, but make sure we actually do okay here. Instead of having our armies completely decimated by Paraguayans or Paraguayans, how about we get them killed off by Argentinians, which actually... July 6, 1854, Argentina is formed, but let's see how long they last. The economy isn't looking so good right now, but it's alright. It's alright. It, don't worry about that. Don't don't think about it. Uh, we're just going to try to take these provinces as fast as humanly possible. We might do well, we might not do well. The economies might collapse. But, yeah. We'll see what happens. That's always the cure. We'll see what happens. I want to pop with them as fast as possible. It's actually nice to only have to go to war with one person here down here. So, so, we'll see. Oh, hello. Oh, Brazil's here too. Oh, we have Brazil's at war with these. Wow. Argentina, you're, you've pissed off a lot of people, haven't you? Nice. Very nice. We do have a little bit of a fleet here, which is going to be kind of a little bit of a concern for us. But that's alright. As long as we don't get too many rebels. And let's go for the capital immediately. Because why not? Also, what other wars are going on right now? We're still at war with Paraguay and Uruguay, which is stupid. I don't understand. Why don't we have a ticking war score? We got what we wanted out of them. Yet they won't give up. So, we have the Crimean War going on, in which the Russians are winning. Wow. Taiping Rebellion. Conquest of Senussi. Brazilian Argentinian War of Honor. So, that's kind of why we're going in as well this time, just because we can do really well here. I'm thinking of con and considering going up to Partido Progressista. Just so we can start... Ooh, you, ooh, Union Liberal. They still have state capitalism, which is nice. Even limited citizenship, too. Just because I do want to start getting some more education and stuff like that. So we'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure if our ships can actually handle battle here. Ah, uh, it's three ships against six. Oh. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um... So, we have to be at peace for this, of course. And we need Uruguay and... Oh, we need Paraguay as well. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're definitely much better suited for this war right now than we were earlier. So, is that not us? Where, oh, there they are. Go home. We lost a ship, huh? It's not ideal. Not bad. Prestige is... Fourth in the world, actually, that's really strong. Uh, Chile. Oh, they're out with Brazil, which is not good. Andorra, of course. Pilar, however you pronounce that. Nice. Oh, hello, sir. Would you like to attack us? Actually, I'll, you are you are good on attack and... Oh, my goodness. Oh, Donald's good on attack and defense. Nice. Ooh, UK and Prussia. Alright, so that's the case. We're going in. I mean, I can't imagine they'd have a plus four attack defense. He's good. He's actually pretty good in defense. That's actually not bad for them. But if this butches our entire army, yeah, we're going to be reeling from the damage from this for a long, long time. Let's go start sieging him down. Nice. Well, these guys had a choice. They chose poorly. War leader, huh? I don't want. I don't like that. Why can't we just do both? Actually, if anything, uh, come back here. We've taken out the capital. We should be okay. <clears throat> I think after this, we might try to be at peace for a little bit. I mean, I, obviously, we can't take out Chile. I want to take out Brazil, but this war score, the military score, is not bad. Peru might be a better one to take out. Peru and Bolivia, yeah, most definitely. Um, we'll see though. I do want. Uh, actually, are you still allied with us? You are still allied with us. They, they all accept too. That's not bad. You've increased relations with the French. The UK love us, loves us, which is awesome. Um, 
Yeah, we definitely gotta fo focus on the budget. I have lower education and administration as well. We just don't have any money. We seriously just don't have any money. So it's kind of an issue for us. Bro, why will you not give this up? This is stupid. That's case we probably lower. I'm just gonna drop it quite a bit. There you go. Good, good. Come on. There we go, that's better. Sympathies. Now you do it. Honestly, I just want to do, it, do you guys separately. Being at war for this long is unacceptable. <sighs> that's so stupid. I hate that so much. But, at least you're both under us, for now. There goes ours, which is great. Um, increased relations as well. I think we might be able to get Bolivia and Peru if we move fast enough, too. So let's at least make him a puppet first. But we'll see what happens. Now it's November 20th, 1855, and it's about time that we go ahead and go to war with bo 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 Bolivia and call in all of our allies, because maybe they'll defeat them for us. Um, we'll call in everybody but... Everybody. Oh. Well, I want to call in everybody but the Austrian Empire, because we technically... They still have a higher ranking than us, and I and I just want to make sure that we can get these guys done like that. Very efficiently. Oh, thanks guys, thanks for coming in. Uruguay, I know you wanted to come in too. So one of the main goals before we go to war with America when they have this little civil war is to make sure that, uh, well, we take out Paraguay so we can form that big old faction, the Vice Royalty down here too. It should be good. Wow, holy crap. The Ottoman Empire is dying like crazy to the Russians. Holy father sons. And the UK just like, I'll take a little bit past the Baltics. Jesus Christ. Alright, buddy, you're gonna suffer through a lot of this? Actually, I just combined the two armies that we had earlier. Just combine them too. It's fine, whatever. Uh, Bolivia has no other way through there, and then we'll go to war with Peru next. Honestly, I might spend time just cutting down, like, infamy to a degree. Because we need to do that as well, so we'll see what happens. If we're already up here, he must take out both these guys, take out these guys as well. We'll see. You know, you never know. But yeah, I'm, I'm really focusing on trying to get more population as fast as possible. And we're making other armies up here too, so don't get me wrong, we're making some other armies too, which would be good. Spanish, Catalan, Spanish, Spanish. Just in case we get some rebels, because our militancy is a little high. It's a little, a little high right now. Move in as fast as you can. So, oh, oh, we choose a trade policy. Um, we need to... I'm not sure which one's the best one to do. I just do this one because we get more minimum tariff and more efficiency. Uh, you know what? Screw it. We'll become more free market for now. Maybe. Yeah, never mind. Not with this tariff efficiency. Holy crap. That's a lot of tariffs. We don't like the outside world, do we? Sucre. Oh, more coal production. Actually, get... Oh, it's going to suck so much. We'll get that done. Also, I realized that the economy was tanking because I was subsidizing all these guys. It's kind of bad if you want to do that. Oh, my goodness. Um, fertilizer. I'm subsidizing this one. That's for... Oh, that's cement, I mean, that's cement. Cement, cannery. Um, I mean, I, I want all these things. We don't really need all these things right now, which is probably bad for us to have. Explosives? Hmm. I don't mind making, like, one or two to be subsidized. Aragon, Spanish Catalonia. Granada. I don't mind making it at least maybe steel. Here, you can have this one. Never mind. You can have that. You're not making any money. Um, glass. Bottles. Not bad. We need money to open this one up too. What do we do that one too? Here. People can go there. No, people will migrate for jobs, so that's fine. Do you want a piece yet? No? Okay. Cool. Anything else here? Not really. Yeah. Oh, people's ideologies, though. They do have ideologies. Um, they're pro-military. It's good. Moralism. Freedom of the womb law. We still have slavery? We have regionalism, huh? Ooh. Federalism looks way better. A lot more green. Even unitary, maybe. Oh, we'll go to Peru as well. Look at that. Let's go that way. The goal by the end of the episode is to make at least... One more. Um. Vice royalty by the end of this. Which I think we should be able to do. We're also going to go to war by like April with Peru. But it shouldn't be too bad. Eh, 18 divisions is not bad. 
Our army's not that great, but what else is new? La Paz? Mobilizations? Uh. Nope! <laughs> French War of Piedmontian freedom against the Austrian Empire. No! No! Well, we're naked and afraid, and by naked and afraid, a Polish uprising, if you want to put that, please go ahead. Help the Poles in any way we can. Pronounce support to these guys. Um. Well, not why not? I don't really want to concern ourselves with those guys. Do you want an alliance? No. Okay. That makes sense. Do you want an alliance? No. Okay. Increase relations because you can. Prussia, would you like an alliance? No. We'll increase relations anyways. Hey, hey, guys. Oh! Oh, man. If we could have the UK help us fight America. Oh, my gosh. That would be so good. Actually, that's actually really smart thinking right there. I like that idea a whole lot. I hope you guys like it as well. Okay, oh, I forgot about that. Thank you very much. Venezuela, I'm too concerned. Oh, we can command the units too. Uh, that actually be really smart to do, but I forgot about that. Uh, Uruguay. You know what? Give me your units, Uruguay. Oh, crap. On the 23rd. Oh, thanks, guys. Thank you. Oh, crap. Now that's not good. Oh, we already maxed out the military spending, though, which is really nice. For the most part. So. Um. You're not looking too hot there, Sebastian. Oh, you're not good on attack. I need someone good on attack. That's minus one. That's not good on attack. Felix, no. Why do you guys suck on attack? You're plus two. Plus one. Morale doesn't really mean too much. Here, plus two. That's fine. I don't care if you have suffered a prestige penalty. I don't really give a crap. Um, uh, my goodness. This is really bad. You got a lot of prestige, though. That's really nice. Santa Anna. Can we not just kill all the rebels? Oh. Thank you. Wait, who are these guys? Jacobins? Oh, they're converging. Oh, boy. I do not want to mobilize everything here. Here, come back up top so we can go to the place because they'll come try to attack us too. Because I don't want to convert a government yet because I still want to make sure that we can stale. Are you kidding me? I hate Jacobins so much. Jacobins deserve to die. He's good on defense. So we'll see how good he is. He's taking out thousands of them. Oh, yeah. Oh, Mr. Islands of Guatemala. When the Panama Canal was planned, several expeditions were sent into the regions of Central America. The inhabitants of the large jungles of Yucatan narrate stories of old cities and treasures. Adventurers and tomb raiders cross and explore these remote areas in rough on ruins or steels. This news may be interesting may be interesting for the Spanish archaeologists. Marcus, give me my bull whip. This is no good. And we need more money too, so we went with tax efficiency, but um Engineer maybe? Oh, he's not good. And we're maxed out on military spending, so. Oh my gosh, this is so stupid. Jacobins, Jacobins, Jacobins. What happens if I change my government right now? We're an absolute monarchy with order, which I don't mind. But at the same time, I just want to win the war in, Amer in South America. Actually, if we change our government, what happens? Because you guys did fine there. Oh, you got way too many people there. Can we just peace out with you? Bro, I don't understand why they're not going to peace out yet. What happens if we do change the government? 100% reactionaries? Let's just see what happens. Because Spain is not out of the population. Spain, trying to play Spain is impossible, man. Yeah, we're going to lose this anyway. So what happens if we do this? Maybe we go in the Baral. Anything change? Because we're going to lose to the Jacobins anyways. And we're going to become anarcho-capitalists. Because we can't fight that. Uh, can we at least stay? Because if this continues, like we, I'll have to go back in time and. Hello. Yeah, there's no way we can fight that. We, we've lost. That is so stupid. So stupid. Um, we lost the capital, huh? I don't know. It just, Spain is impossible. You can't fight that. You just can't. 
Why do we keep getting the Cristianos? This is so stupid. I hate this so much. Cristinos. So, I don't know. I'll probably do some funky stuff off screen. But at least can we get, at least get Bolivia? I don't know why they're not giving up yet. We took the capital. We burned it to the ground. It should be good enough. Bro, seriously, give it up. Get get back here. I will whip you into the ground. Well, now we're bankrupt. Thanks. Look at what these liberals wanted. Bankruptcy. Andorra doing Andorra things. Hmm. The new liberal regime. So this is what happens when we do this. Jacobin rebels. Oh, we lost less prestige than I thought we would. This time plurality, freedom has passed. So why don't trust liberals? During the recent in power, they've already begun new changes to the kingdom of Spain. We felt here and abroad. So we're still at war with them, which is fine. Um. Okay, so we can still do that. Okay. I'm okay with that then. We're a constitutional monarchy. You know what? That's okay. But liberals, man. Jacobins. I guess they're not liberals, but just Jacobins. Ooh, slave demographics. Oh. Huh. As long as we can still do what we want to do here. That's all I care about. As long as we can still get the vice royalties. Because, God, I hate this so much. I hate the rebel system in Vicky 2. It's so un... un... player friendly. It's not fun at all. Uh, regardless. I want them to rise up again. I want to murder every last one of them. Can I, can you know I like to see them Vicky three? Can we ban or expel Jacobins? I would love to just murder every single Jacobin out there. Christinos, support the royal line of Ferdinand the seventh. Well, restore the liberal reforms enacted by the previous royal line. No longer reactionaries, which I, you know might be best if we are not, but still. Oh my goodness, I hate the party. Oh my goodness, we can't tax the crap out of. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's so bad. That's so bad. Seriously, bro. Now you want to do it, you piece of garbage. Well, immediately to Peru. Oh, we can't do that. Now we got to do this one too. Wow, this just kind of sucks. This. Oh, we can actually intervene. Nah, we're okay. And now, everyone, we are, of course, at war with Peru because... Why not? We like Peru, right? And I was asking quite a bit, like, I forgot. What's the capital of Peru? Apparently the capital of Peru is Lima. It's by that big old red dot right there. So what we're going to do is try to win as fast as possible, puppet them, and form some sort of vice royalty. Vice royalty, right? Yeah, you guys are looking a-okay. You guys are looking okay as well. Um, we just need more money, man. Actually, oh, actually, do you have any units? No, you don't. God dang it. Cell's been discovered. That sucks, bro. Uh, put down a lot of militancy. I'm um, still building up here, right? Eh, somewhat-ish. Use another... Actually, engineer would be nice. Alright. Not bad, but yeah. Spain is... Spain's a little difficult to play as. Spain is especially Carlos Spain. I guess it's just Spain in general. Spain is a lot of pain. Uh, you're gonna attack, right? So, let's come over here. Discover... Is this jungle? Is this hard to... Ooh. Ah, eh, screw it. Let him do it. Whatever. Now we're gonna get some okay money. Especially since we went to the conservative party. Tax the crap out of the lower classes. Seriously, tax the crap out of them. We're gonna spend so much on everything else. Ridiculous. Basically going bankrupt, man. Not cool. Not cool whatsoever. But we've done okay so far. Oh, hello. Peru, yes. There's a navy over there. Would you like to go to... No. We need a war goal. Also, we did get the UK to attack, attack them as well, which is actually kind of nice. I did the whole thing where the UK asked for an alliance. Actually, no. I asked the UK for an alliance, and then Italy wanted an alliance with us. So I'm like, okay. Why not? We'll gladly take it. Poke in China campaign. Hey, France, you want to increase relations? Sure, why not? We'll be buddies for now. 
Ooh, it's a little laggy here, too. Ah, uh, I love having allies here. Actually. Oh, my goodness. It's getting very laggy. You're still in the escalator. You're not allied. What? Bro. You not love us? You not love us? America? They really don't love us. Um, I hope that they get the Confederacy gets Kentucky, not Indiana, even Missouri. That'd be really good. Ooh, Kansas. None of the Dakotas, which makes sense. And then over there, so. Well, but we get the Confederacy too much. Honestly, we didn't really weaken it that much. And actually, without these guys getting California and Colorado, all of Colorado, Utah, Arizona, New Mexico, Wyoming. Hopefully, we can do really well. Oh, what? How did they take Panama already? What? What? How did they get Panama? What the heck? Where's the source of the Nile? The Royal Geographic Society announced the war. We presented the first explorer to determine the source of the Nile. We didn't need money. We don't believe in money here. We barely have any money. How's the economy looking? Um, it's not bad actually. And so is this Catalonia. We actually have a few capitals here. Not bad. Not bad. We're trying to get in interchangeable parts, and I'm trying to just do the entire like coast campaign. So, liberals, conservatives, reactionaries. Not bad. Not bad. And actually, you hope you guys. Ecuador. You know what? It's only ten. We got. We got time. Maybe. Just gotta get. Oh my gosh, that's so much infamy. Whatever. We'll cut it down. I mean, the main goal of this campaign is just reunite all of America's interests. So. Pandora. Spell discovered. Good. Find and kill every last one of them off. Hello, sir. Are you still in the jungle? Yeah. Oh! Baltic Union. Oh. German Landtag, huh? Oh, they're war, the Russian Empire. Huh. Okay. Okay. Well, actually, you're one too many cannons. Nice. Any more guys we can throw here? Infantry, Hussars, yes. Man cooking China. Alright. Oh! Nice, there we go. Spanish South America. That's looking pretty nice, but now, the Vice Royalty of Peru. At least we got another one then. Peru was, by, was the site of many feudal attempts by Ferdinand VII to conquer South America. However, this time, the rebellious colonists have been out soundly defeated. The Republic of Bolivia, named after El Libera Liberator, must cease to exist. Must cease to exist as an entity and be incorporated into the vice royalty of Peru. Oh, they become a republic. Well, it is what it is. I guess we got it done. When his vassals choose a tech school, so we still got to do Rio de la Plata. We got to take a Paraguay, and Chile has to die as well. Oh, look at that. So we definitely need Paraguay under us as well. We have a truce with them until... Ooh, it's not bad, 1960. The ally with Chile, we might be able to do a double whammy, maybe. Are we still just finding anybody? Ecuador. Well, it's kind of an ugly color. Partido Popular. Well, since we're here, let's keep going on, I guess. Nice. Uh, 24, 24, 30. Come to the coast. Enjoy the coast while we have it, right? I like this. Oh, and actually, since we're here, there you go. Keep that high. Venezuela, Uruguay. It's fine if they don't like us. They'll be annexed eventually. These guys don't like us. That's fine. Whatever. Um, I don't know. I should have just directly annexed them, but whatever. All right. All right. Not bad. Um. Definitely want a state and government, because that would be really good for us, for more plurality, and then we'll go for another military one. What is this looking like? Max it out. More production could. We're not taxing the upper class at all. Let's go right there. So take us a little bit more. It's fine. You're not refilling it, your men yet, which kind of kind of uh, scared me. Did they break our alliance? Yeah, they did. It's not ideal. Uh, French Empire. Would you like an alliance? No. Would anyone like an alliance with us? We're not that strong. Hope the North German Federation forms, actually, eventually. You guys know. Russian Empire, probably not. Do we still have Italy? Oh, we still have Italy. That's still not saying very much, though. 
Oh no. Okay, so eighth power in the world. Could be worse. Oh, okay, now our guy's looking pretty good. Yeah, actually, do we still have... Yeah, civilizing mission. It's not bad. I like that a lot. Suppression efficiency. Suppress them as hard as you possibly can. Demand Bur Burmese, uh, Burmese Pegu. Got a lot of money now, right now. We're going to need it because I'm going to crash the economy again. I'm really good at crashing economies. I try not to sometimes, but it just happens. You know, it just happens. It just works. Italy will not accept. Well, tough nuts, Italy. Which means we need another new ally. Italy is not accepted. I can't doubt any of these guys would. Honestly, I don't want the French. Is the French going to ally with us? I'm okay with that. Darn it. Well, let's keep increasing relations with the French. We can use some engineers over here, too. Where are they going? They're probably Pura. It's fine. What is this? Oh. Good. No. Well, after tur I guess, you know, giving people a representative democracy helps us out a little bit, but still. We suffered quite a bit in this campaign so far. That's fine. That's fine. I don't want to lower the trust maybe a little bit more. Maybe not that much. Okay. Maybe not that much. We're not ready for that yet. Not for that type of shock. Alright, not bad. Nice. Oh, hey, our guys are helping out. Yay! Please don't... Oh, you're losing, are you? Uh, the Licensing Act. Influenced by intensive lobbying from the Temperance League, one of our states has adopted a licensing regulation that allows residents the right to issue or attract liquor licenses in their local districts. With strong public support, the Licensing Act has thus prohibited the sale of liquor throughout the state. Many local breweries have been denied the right to sell their product locally and have been forced into bankruptcy. Forced to repeal. Quito would be nice. Let's do this, though. God, I want Colombia so badly. Social. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, they're having the Brothers' War now. Look at that. Look, man. You could have been allies, but you chose not to. Oh, you want to be an ally now? I like Prussia more. Because having Germany on our side would be very nice. Also, we did go to all the allowed rights, which actually helps us out, helps us out quite a bit for militancy, for non accepted at least. It's all right. Immigrant attraction, of course. What do people want? Moralism. Moralism. All allowed. I want more social reform desire. Oh, Cassus Belly acquisition speed. Ooh, we don't definitely don't want that one. Um, immigrant attraction is not bad. Secret ballots. Eh. Go all lot. That's fine. Go that one. Hey, Prussia. I hope you win your war. I really do. I really hope you win your war. Oh, we're only tenth in the world for military. That sucks. Quito. Uh, help him out here. Recruitment drive. Our armed forces have conducted a major recruitment drive across the country, and recruits have been flocking to the banners. The drive cannot have been conductive, says the military, without the government's policy for strong support for the military. We can channel the positive or public relations from this drive to either reduce the people's war exhaustion or push for the military gains. Um, what's how much war exhaustion? Uh, that's quite a bit. Yeah, we can lower as much as... Uh, you know what, screw it. Jingoism. Nice. So, do you want to give up yet? No? All right, free allied cores of Peru. I mean, that's basically what we're doing already. Oh, nice. Uh, Prussia, third war against Austria. Oh, in commission warship. New Granada, Rio de la Plata. Uh, Colombia, Ecuador, and Colombia. Okay, we, need, we already have Colombia. We need that one. We need Chile next. Well, it's getting dangerously close, though, to having a little bit of Confederate fight very soon. It's 99 military score. We have 55. King Cotton, Free Staters. Oh. Well, Prussia, it looks like... You know what? They'll be able to win. That's fine. Maybe. Oh, my gosh. Holy crap. At this point, as much as I want to take these guys out, we're going to go to war with America. Let's take a look at Colombia maybe first. Mm, this is going to be a mess, isn't it? Oh, it's going to be a mighty mess. Or take a Paraguay. Let's take a Paraguay if we can first. It is 1860. Go to war with them first. 
Ooh. And then we can form another vice royalty as well. That's kind of the idea. So we take out these guys, form the vice royalty, then we go to America, or we'll have to wait till the Great War, really. Yeah, I mean, we don't have to take out America right now. It's just easier when they have the Confederates there, so... Uh, that's probably what we're going to do, is we're going to watch this just a little bit. I do want to see what happens. Oh, boy. No cells been discovered. That's good. Um, anything else happening over here? These guys are doing definitely doing okay. I want you to open up. Well, it looks like they're winning so far. Oh! Someone just beast out there. Oh, yeah, some of the South Germans did. Yeah, Prussia, we're helping you out. We love you, Prussia. Uh, you might want to move 30,000 soldiers over so you can actually do something there. Treaty of Wien. Following the defeat of our armies in the Brothers' War against Prussia, we've been forced to sign the Prussian demands and lost all influence among German states. Well, we should have the NGF form very soon. Well, everyone, the time is now. The Confederate States, as you see, are here, and they're doing... Eh, they're not doing bad. They've actually taken out some uh, some Union territory, but it looks like the Union boys are coming back. Go and give them a run for their money. We've almost got strategic mobility, but we've got Lagardia Civil right now. Lagardia Civil, Spanish for the Civil Guard, is a, the Spanish Gendarmerie Corps, established during the reign of Queen Isabel II to suppress lingering Carlist sentiments and the countryside after the liberal victory in the Carlist Wars. The Corps is a blend between the police and military force, operating on a federal level, and has remained in existence through to modern times. Nice. And just to do all this stuff, but as you can see on the top of the screen before we go to war, we're actually at war with these guys already. Paraguay, I've commanded, I sent a lot of our units actually away. Um, truth be told, uh, yeah, we're doing okay this year. Um, go to Santiago. I'm trying to kill these guys. I'm just using our puppet divisions just because we're going to go to war with these guys right now and see what we can do. Humiliate. Now, hopefully, Germany does get involved. Germany will get involved. The Confederate States are already at war with them, so. Hopefully this will work okay. Because we already have our divisions here somewhat, right? Yeah. They're already down here just kind of hanging out. Um, hopefully we come up here and do okay. Ooh. And Germany has gotten involved too, which is nice. Very, very good. Even though it looks like we're just losing tons and tons of money. Cancel subsidies then. Uh, let's see. Capitalism. I like that one the most. Let's see what we can do. Uh, we're fighting Colombia too. God dang it. That's fine. Oh. Wait. Did they... Are they peace out? Uh, I mean, they're in our sphere. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, conservatives won again. Spanish American War of Honor. Hopefully, uh, North Germany, North German Federation is up for the war. Oh boy. And they like us. They like us quite a bit. Uh, rule quality and support. I prefer that one. And go with that one. That's fine. Oh, that's not good. Actually, are you guys at war them too? You are, which is good. We could command units, but they're doing okay with that anyways. Joplin? We'll start with Joplin. Oh, boy. And you guys have a truce with them until 67. So, oh, man. This might have been a bad idea. Guys are still trying to fight down here too. Uh, we'll see. Oh, you guys are down here too. That's not bad. Combine you guys. Yeah, maybe it was a bit too much to handle. Oh. Are you guys stuck? Well, the Confederates have actually won. Go flip and figure. And we got Joplin. Also, I did choose the, uh... Huh. The Humiliate one, because that was the cheapest one we could do. So, hey, this guy actually really likes us a lot. French Republic here. Peace relations. Well, we got 2%. They don't have a lot of score, which is actually really good. If anything, I would take a, sti a stability hit, but like... Oh. When do we have divisions down here? I forgot about these guys. Uh, get down here to the mountains. Yeah, get to the mountains and just stay there. I forgot about you guys. Why did I forget about you all? Huh. San Pedro, would you like to peace out? War goal? We got like cores? No, we're good. We're good for now. Ooh, the rebels down there too. We'll deal with Colombia. No, honestly, how much would it take to puppet them? Ten is a bit much. 
Ooh, that's not good. Oh! They're... They're winning, though. Bernardo Boca Negra. He do be doing okay. Wait. Found Robert E. Lee. My god, his army's looking god-awful. <laughs> Holy crap. We are allied, and they're in our sphere, so... We'll see what happens. <laughs> As you can see, uh, Austria Hungary also played for him as well. So, oh, Bulgaria's here too. Look at that, Romania, Bavaria, of course. All right, how good are these guys? Benjamin Chapman, are you good on it? Oh yeah, definitely lead with the attack. Oh, that's nice. Actually, before we, so we see this army again. They have no cavalry. They're actually not bad on defense. They actually dug in. Oh, that's not good. Unification with South African Republic. It's not bad. St. Louis? Oh. Alright, we actually won a battle against these guys. That's good. Right? Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. They're taking out our puppet up there. Hmm. Not ideal. Calling a crisis. If you want about that, please go right ahead. Not bad. Oh. Ah. Uh. How? We didn't attack them, they attacked us. Well, crap, that's not good. We haven't had any rebels here, too, which is kind of concerning. I hope we've not had any rebels back since we had that one thing happen. Wow, the French are really taking out Morocco. You guys are south, you guys are fine, you guys go, uh... Actually, first of all, combine and go there. So taking that area out as well. Ooh. Technically, I'm gonna combine all of you together. Go to Puka Orko. Venezuela's dying. I hope Germany can show up, please. I definitely don't want to have to mobilize, but if I have to, I will. That's not bad so far. Spanish American War of Honor. Dismantle would be extremely nice. We didn't have the option earlier, but whatever. Yeah, this is not going to be looking good here. They're not doing terribly. Yeah, they don't have a lot. Of, they got a lot of cannons. They don't have a lot of infantry though, which is very concerning. We have it as. That's fine. We got these guys too. So, when do you want to go to peace, uh, Paraguay? Concepcion? Probably after you get the capital under control. Come on. Come on. Valparaiso. We got him. Nice. Who's the war leader? Oh, is Paraguay the war leader? Oh, we're not the war leader. Germany is. That's right. Oh, crap. That's not good. Um, honestly, they might actually have enough division to take them out. You know what? We could be in a lot, lot worse spot. Their military score is 51 while well, mobilized. Maybe we can do well? I mean, I'm very surprised that the Confederates actually won. But... I mean, their score is only 30. And Robert E. e. Lee, somehow all the way down in Texas... Which is very concerning because he's technically literally the leads the army of Northern Virginia. Oh, what happened? Okay, okay, we can deal with that. So once we go to peace, we can make the vice royalty, which would be very nice actually. Uh, we need breach loaded rifles as well. So all you guys now, oh, well, we can. Excuse me. Oh, they're not at war. Oh, they are at war with those guys. I need a warning. What? Uh, that's weird. You can't command the units anymore. Well, at least we're done with that war for now. That's nice. And I was supposed to take those guys out. So. Yeah. Okay. Sure, why not? You know what? We got these guys here. 
We'll go in. Hopefully we do okay. Our ally is not doing that badly at all. Peoria? Okay. North... I'm not sure how much you guys are actually doing up here, but hopefully they're doing something. And we're still trying to increase, like, intellectuals and whatnot here as well, just because... Education, so 30%, you know, it could be worse. It could honestly be a lot worse than what currently is at. And I'm still trying to get more soldiers, too, so. Um, not bad. Not, not bad at all. More more military stuff is great. Um, I still want to get some more... Ooh, that'd be so good. Ooh. Empiricism, though. Definitely. Oh, Germany is down here, though. Oh, hello. Ah! Wait, why can we do that now? Oh, do they have, they had to do one of these? Okay. So then, what happens about this territory? I don't know. Let's at least make it. So, uh, where are we at? No Geneva Convention. No, thank you. The Vice Royalty of Rio de la Plata. The Vice Royalty of the Rio de la Plata was the last to be organized and also the shortest lived of the Vice Royalty of the Spanish Empire in the Americas. Now that the three breakaway countries of the region are now under our control, we should reestablish the Vice Royalty to more effectively rule the region. We're still a constitutional monarchy. Oh! Ew! Oh, don't tell me that's bugged. Oh, why do we own this? We should not own this. Oh, don't get me wrong, I'll, I'll expand infrastructure and stuff, but like, what? Why? I mean, I don't mind Rio de la Plata, but... Oh, wait, we're at peace? What happened? Oh! Demand reparation. Well, Schneikies. We form a new thing, and we go to peace. Okay. Um, not bad. Yeah, not bad at all. Obviously, we'll have to kill the Confederacies later, but we just needed them under us for now. Just to make sure that they could stay under us and stuff. So, I don't mind improving infrastructure here. We do need to cut down on our infamy a little bit. We're no longer at war with Chile, which does kind of suck. Um, let's cut down on the military spending just a little bit, because it's costing us quite a bit, I'd say, for now. Um, well, the Confederates are alive. That's kind of nice. I don't like this. Why Why do we... Can I give it back to anybody? Uh, Chile. New Granada. Maybe I should have waited for them to get all this territory first, but that wouldn't make any sense either. Um, Patagonia's down there. I don't know. We're doing the best we can here. It's not going to be perfect the way we do this, but... I don't know. But hey, at least we got the Confederates here. I mean, how, why did they give up? I mean, I guess it makes sense. I mean, they gave up against the Confederates so early. The Confederates weren't doing that badly. Or the, the USA was... The, the normal North wasn't doing that badly, but they gave up. And now they, the, the US gave up against us too. I, you know, I, I'm expecting a challenge here and something much more ridiculous than this, but you know what? I'll take it, but that's probably where we're going to leave it for today just because this has gone a little crazy and, uh, I don't know. We've got to figure out what we want to do. Not bad, though. I mean, we have a good chunk of these guys and then these guys as well, and then we'll have Chile next time. We've got Paraguay done with. We'll get Colombia next time as well, and maybe we'll actually beat up more of America, maybe buff the Confederates, or maybe take them out ourselves. I don't know. We'll see what happens. This has turned out very, very weird. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when I've cut down more infamy, and maybe take out more people, and maybe even take out the French. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.